Hi, I'm Wendy with Doll Wedding Company, and I'm going to show you how to make a wedding bow. Making a bow is something I think is very important to learn, whether or not you're getting married. You can use them on gifts that you give to people. You can use them all over your wedding, most commonly used on the wedding pews, also on archways and throughout different elements of the wedding. It's quite simple, actually, how you can make it. All you have to do is watch. Okay, so I'm going to make a bow. I have wired ribbon. They have wires along the sides of each side of the ribbon. I like to use wired ribbon because it keeps its shape a lot nicer. So you start out with a simple loop. And this is going to be the bottom of your bow. So you keep it so that it's bent in half, where it comes back in the center, and then where the seam is on the ribbon or the end of your ribbon becomes the center of your bow. So now that I have my center established, I'm going to pinch it right in the middle, and then I make a twist with each different layer of the bow. And I like to do two layers of the bow at the same length, and then I start to make it shorter. So that I've got my two, and I twist it again. And this time we're going to make it just a bit shorter. And twist it again. The hardest thing to do is just to keep pinching that middle point. Now a little bit shorter. Twisting it almost to the end. I'd say it takes a good four or five yards to make a good bow. That's nice and full. Okay, now I've reached the top. There's several ways you can do this. My favorite way is to take a separate piece of ribbon and to tie it around your bow, just like so, giving your bow the finished look of having a knot. Then you take back those two pieces that we just created and you just adjust the ribbon. The more ribbon you use, the fuller your bow. Okay, so now you have your finished bow, and it has a good tail on the back of it, so you can attach it to anything. A good way to attach it would be to, you could actually use the two pieces of ribbon here, or you could just insert a pipe cleaner right through the back and attach it to anything. It hangs well, it sits well on a gift, it's something that's versatile and you can use it anywhere. Thanks for watching How to Make Wedding Bows. With a little bit of practice, you too can learn how to be an expert at making bows.